Hey, I'm back with another wonderful hat video here for you. All right, uh, with this video, we're going to be looking into uh, fantastic hat style trends for 2024. Okay, that's what we're going to be looking at for this uh, video here. We're going to kind of go through some uh, hat style trends that are kind of coming back for 2024 and maybe uh, a few new pieces here and there. You know, a lot of the stuff that I'm going to show you today, uh, they're pretty much uh, classics that, that, that have been in style for the last, uh, I say at least, uh, uh, five plus years or so. You know, there are a few pieces, you know, that kind of, that I'm going to kind of show you that are uh, maybe kind of new with colors, you know, that type of thing. But there are a lot of uh, classic styles that uh, they haven't gone out of style. That have been in style for the last five plus years. Some of them, they've been in style for the last 10, 15 plus years. You know what now? But like I said, there are a few pieces that I kind of put together, you know, that are, uh, you know, kind of new, maybe colorways, that type of thing. Some some of these, even they've been around for the last couple couple years. Some of the, the biggest manufacturers of uh, hats within the U.S. and, uh, maybe one or two outside of the US, you know, as well. You know, they might come up with a new colorway or something like that. Uh, but there are lots of stuff that are classics here that the styles, they never go out of style. They've, they've been coming back. Some of them, they've been around for a couple of decades. Like I said, you know, some of them about 10 plus years, 15 years, uh, you know. So even some of them are older than that, uh, you know, 30 years, 40 years, you know, whatnot. Uh, and, uh, you know, because they're just hats, I call them the uh, bread and butter hats, okay? Uh, when it comes to, uh, you know, folks in the hat business, whatnot, those are the hats that they automatically move themselves, you know, that, you know, uh, customers keep coming back for over and over and over and over. They never go out of style, you know. You could have the same hat in maybe about two, three, four, five different colors, that type of thing, you know. So, um, again, folks, if you are, it's your first time on the channel, I'm G the Hat Guy, I'm a hat retailer. You know, hat connoisseur, hat enthusiast, huge fan of hats all around. I'm also into shoes as well, uh, but I don't sell shoes, uh, you know. Well, like I said, you know, I do different things with hats. I make hats as well, you know, uh, do maintenance on hats, change sweatbands, that type of thing, you know. Uh, so let's get right into it and see uh, what we're talking about for 2024. Let's see here. Okay. Yeah, right in front of me here, I've got a few pieces. Uh, let's see. Yeah, something like this. These are classics. They never go out of style. These have been around, you know, for at least I can say 10 plus years. You know, probably 15, 20 years. You know, they never go out of style. You know, these are classic styles that hat fans, hat enthusiasts, they keep coming back for. You know, and this comes in several different colorways. Okay, from black to whiskey to brown to burgundy to uh, even uh, like olive green, you know, uh, regular green, all kinds of colors, you know, so camel color, etc. Um, different tones, you know. Oh, this is classic fedora here. You know, you've got your center dent, two pinches in the front. This is a European fur felt. It's got that multicolor feather. She's got some chocolate, some copper, beige, black, and white in that feather. You have a contrast band in the black. The uh, brim size is a classic fedora uh, brim size. I say about that two and a quarter inch. You know, not too big, not too wide for folks that don't like the brims too wide or too short, that type of thing. She's got that cowhide. Um, sweat bend on the inside it's got the satin lining so this is a classic you know this comes back year after year after year you know i mean it's something that uh again folks they might have you know this same hat they might have in about two three four five six ten different colors you know that type of thing because it's just a classic look that fits a lot of people that never goes out of style you could put it with any kind of outfit that type of thing okay so that's the first one showing you there see what else we got here folks bear with me here if you're kind of new to my videos you know i film with one hand and 
show you the merch with another hand so bear with me here all right okay let's see what else we got here uh there's something like this as well this is pretty classic you know got the teardrop top two pinches got the multicolor feather this is navy on navy it's a dark navy color okay and uh let's see it's got the uh satin lining cow high sweatband on the inside there uh yeah so something like this here you know again another classic it comes in like chocolate brown black dark navy get in whiskey camel rust orange several different colors something like this comes in you know it's classic comes year after year you know again the brim size on this one is about two uh say about two three eighths right around there maybe yeah i say about two three eighths on this one you know something like this here all right Let's see what else we got something like this uh, the brim size on this one is about two say about two and a half inches wide it's got the raw edge there's no binding on it again multicolor hat you know uh, another classic style that keeps coming year after year you know in the hat business whatnot uh, you know uh, different uh, hat shops carry this you know in, in the uh, in the hat business whatnot it's another classic type look center dent two pinches in the front this is black on black color okay a little bit wider size brim like i said yeah, you got the satin lining cow hide sweat band on the inside european rabbit fur felt okay again another classic look <clears throat> excuse me Let's see here uh, what else we got you got a center dent hat here this is just got a center dent and the charcoal contrast band in the black okay again this comes in like whiskey brown uh, camel navy you name it charcoal all of that satin sweatband cow high uh, sweatband satin lining on the inside okay multicolor feather okay this is real similar looks like the uh, run DMC hat that Rev Run was wearing and and uh, you know likes to wear uh, back in the day when he used to uh, rap and stuff like that and uh in that movie what's that hip-hop movie that they did again uh i can't remember the name of it you know it had several uh 80s uh uh rap stars in it back in the day yeah but yeah there you go there's another classic type look that keeps coming year after year you know never goes out of style yeah i call that one like the rev run hat this is the same hat here you know, kind of like a uh, like a whiskey brown type color, center dent, black band, contrast, cow high, satin lining on the inside. The edge is kind of folded over, bound over, and stitched. It doesn't have the ribbon stitch. There's no ribbon binding on there. Okay, so there's a different color uh, way on that one. Yeah, so this is coming. These are all coming back for twenty. Uh, 24 like I said it's one of those that uh, never goes out of style type thing you know keeps coming year after year here's another classic look okay this is with a different manufacturer this is all wool okay it's got that folded over uh, edge there no lining it's got a cotton sweatband on the inside okay center dent this is what you call original light felt wool is what this is a special kind of wool okay and uh, now uh, within the last several years there's been uh, a few different manufacturers that come up with their own version but the original life felt you know belongs to a particular manufacturer or whatnot they came out with this first whatnot so it's got some some copycats of their own version they won't call it original life felt you know uh, because I believe that might be like a uh, uh, exclusive to that particular uh, manufacturer or whatnot uh, again and I'm not trying to promote or give a shout out to any particular brand I'm just showing the hats you know um, whatnot if there's any brand out there manufacturer you're trying to promote your brand you know 
send me a message in the comment section. Check me out at uh, the Hatter's Lounge by G the Hat Guy on Facebook. You can send me a message and let me know if we can talk about that. Okay, this is all like a uh, burgundy type. This particular hat, I believe, maybe comes in about 15 plus, uh, somewhere around there, 10, 15 plus uh, color uh, tones. And every almost about every year, they keep coming out with new colors. Maybe they might take away a color if it's not doing that good, that type of thing, and replace it with another one. But this particular hat is a top selling hat, okay, with, 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 with the particular uh, manufacturer. It comes in several different colors, brown, yellow, green, all kinds of, you know, blues, all kinds of tones. You can find this, navy, etc. okay. This the burgundy here, and uh, I believe I had the green here somewhere too, but not. Uh, yeah, but that's that's the burgundy you're looking at. Uh, I had the uh, olive green around here somewhere. Uh, but anyways, let's see. Uh, all right, folks, uh, I'm gonna let you check out these uh, pictures here that I'm showing you for some additional uh, hats, uh, fantastic hats. Uh, that are coming back for uh, uh, 2024 okay all right check these out yeah the wide brims um yeah these are always going to be in style whatnot uh see the wide brims sort of like a taupe color here wide brim uh with the bound edge you've got the navy the same hat and the navy color whatnot uh you've got another one here in the charcoal with a light blue uh, band you got the black with a purple trim and band you got the navy white brim here the multicolor feather these are classic hats this one's a classic in a gray here with a black band uh, you've got the chocolate brown with a multicolor feather here classic another classic style another classic here in the dark navy uh, these are all coming back with 2024 uh, fantastic hat styles you see another brown one here you see the uh, teardrop top here uh, with the red trim. You've got the pork pie, navy upon navy, stuff like this are classic. These are uh, bread and uh, butter hats. Camel color, classic pork pie. You see another one here, sort of like a rodeo uh, crease style, black. You've got the uh, burgundy one here. The classic uh, wide brims. Another classic navy with a light blue trim there. Got a classic center dent hat with a black band. These are classics. They keep coming back year after year. Non-stop. You've got a chocolate brown one with a bronze uh, hat band on it. You've got this uh, cone-shaped hat here with a center dent, you know, with the cuffs. And the chocolate color, camel color earlier. Yeah, this this sort of came around about two years ago. You've got the bucket uh, fur felt, uh, wool felt hat here. Sort of like a fuzzy wool finish on there looks like a velour and then you've got the smooth finish same style hat so like a bucket uh wool felt hat okay this is a new style came out about a couple years ago i believe with this particular manufacturer you've got this one here uh with a pin on the side you know uh with a cut off brim you see there you know multicolor in the sunshine yellow type color here okay this that came out about a couple years ago you've got the wide brim pork pie uh, with a nail on the side, vintage style nail. It's got the bright yellow, same hat with a black band. Okay, you've got the uh, bolero style white brim oakland crown here. Okay, you've got the safari style in the camo uh, type color. You've got this one here in the mix, uh, charcoal and gray finish color wool. You've got the multicolor in the camo style design with the yellow. You've got another one, same hat in the camo gray multicolor you've got a dark navy safari outdoor style felt you know you've got a wide brim with a pencil curl edge you see that with that orange uh band you've got another wide brim here pork pie style with a card vintage style with a bandana uh wrapped around it you know in the black there okay these are popular style within the last several years here another wide brim in the coral color in the black You've got the uh, diamond uh, crown top, wide brim. You've got the Monty style, like the Mountaineer Monty style uh, hat, wide brim with a pencil curl. Again, the Mountaineer style in the burgundy. Okay, uh, the Monty style hat with no band. You see that in the black right there. 
We have another uh, wide brim here with a buckle belt leather here. Okay, with an off-white color. It's got the same hat and the black. Uh, actually, in the navy, dark navy. You've got the chocolate uh, Sundance fedora hat here, wide brim with the multicolor feather. Another one, wide brim. Okay, with a teardrop top. We have another one with a thin band, same hat in the black. Okay, with a teardrop top. Teardrop top, you know, another one. Sort of like a gambler style on this one here. Same hat in the charcoal gray with a black uh, band uh, off uh, leather uh, vinyl uh, band. It's got there in the royal blue. It's got the charcoal teardrop top, leather hat, white brim. Okay, all of these came out uh, within the last few years or so here. Uh, I say about two, two, two to three years, uh, somewhere around there. You got the copper colored, burnt orange, wide brim. You got the taupe colored, wide brim here. Okay, you've got another copper, burnt orange colored, wide brim with the vintage nail on the side. You've got the diamond top uh, hat here with a vintage nail, uh, off leather band there. You've got another black uh, teardrop top. Another diamond top, sort of like a uh, dark turquoise color. Okay. We've got a chocolate uh, diamond top uh, with a chocolate band. Okay. We've got an off-white uh, uh, wide brim there with a long feather in black. Same hat with a long feather in black, sort of like a uh, coral orange. we got an off-white uh, medium brim with a vintage nail. Same hat in the dark turquoise type color right there. Got an olive green uh, teardrop top with a vintage nail black band, same hat, and like a dark gray, charcoal gray with a vintage nail right there. Got a brown hat, vintage nail style with a burnt orange, uh, with an orange uh, hat band. You got a safari style wide brim here with a feather and a nail, vintage style nail, multicolor feather, long feather. Same one in that taupe color, same one in sunshine yellow. Uh, well, this is a different one here. Sunshine yellow. It's got a wide brim, vintage nail, long feather. Okay, all of these came out within the last uh, three to five years. This style here, chocolate brown with a vintage nail, uh, cut off uh, hat band. It's got a black on black there, wide brim. You've got the uh, uh, light orange uh, wide brim there. You've got the ivy style cap and the, the off wool, uh, wool blend uh, check pattern. You've got the, another one like the houndstooth design there, uh, wool blend. You've got another one like a, uh, a Boston Scotty style cap there. You've got the uh, western hat with a open crown, with a cattleman's open crown. You've got a rodeo style crown in chocolate in a uh, charcoal color. You've got a black uh, cattleman's crown right there. You've got a rodeo style crown in a camel color. Okay, uh, I've got a buckle in a purple. Like a rodeo style crown, uh, western hat, same hat, you know, in the fluorescent green with a buckle here, rodeo style. You've got this uh, new newsboy patchwork here, combination with black and navy, etc. You've got the coral color uh, uh, fedora hat right there, same hat in a turquoise blue, same hat in a uh, brown mix color, okay. Yeah, this is a classic. With this particular manufacturer, this is a classic hat. It comes in several different colors. Same hat in the, in the uh, burnt orange. A different hat here in the chalk, in a black color. Another hat, different hat, safari style in the black wool. Uh, this is another wool here. A lot of these hats that I showed uh, the last few pictures, they're, they're like wool. They're not felt. They're like wool. They have different types of finishes. Wool. Same thing with this. This is wool here in the off white. Uh, with an imitation leather band there. Uh, another wool, safari style, and uh, dark orange and olives. Uh, they come in a variety of colors. Some of the colors uh, are updated. They might take away one color because it's not really doing that well and replace it with another one. This is an off green, olive green, same hat. Uh, same hat here with a camo mix uh, color. Really, really nice and different. Another wide brim here with the uh, imitation leather band, same hat. So like a dark charcoal color here uh, with the imitation leather, turquoise blue. This is another classic one with this particular uh, manufacturer with the uh, light turquoise. Sunshine yellow, uh, mustard yellow, uh, pork pie. 
Here's another uh, like a forest green, same hat. Real popular, comes in probably about 17 different colors or so, that one. If this pork pie, there you go in the cherry red type color and the light olive green. This one has been around for about the last five, five to seven years or so, this particular, with this particular manufacturer. This is like a whiskey color pork pie there. Red cattleman's crease buckle uh, western hat, another one. Uh, you know, it's got the rodeo star crown, okay. Another one, royal blue with a buckle, rodeo star crown, turquoise blue, cattleman's crease. These are classics, and this, these are wool too. These are western hats, these are wool, okay. Uh, and the camel color here, these are all wool in a, in a gray color right here. These are wool, and they're doing really good. They said with this particular manufacturer, these ones are selling really good. All of these are coming back for 2024. You know, classic newsboy leather, okay. Uh, classic uh, genuine lambskin leather. Uh, you've got a five uh, panel cap there. Classic, that manufacturer, they've had that for several years now. Uh, this is just came out about two years ago. This new newsboys here. It's got the herringbone uh, designs here, okay. You've got the uh, classic ivy. Uh, this has been around for several years, probably at least 10 plus years or so, uh, somewhere around there. Uh, another newsboy, this is fairly new, about two or three years old or so. Uh, herringbone newsboy with this particular manufacturer. Uh, that's been around for a while. It's got another white brim here, you know, off white charcoal, same hat, you know, you know off white. It's got the binding on the edge there. It's got the bucket hat. This is new for 2024. This, this is a new style. Uh, with the tie dye type design, this 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 another casual hat here in the royal blue. That's new. This is new here with the uh, uh, old school uh, hats style there for for the summer. Uh, you've got the uh, the uh, fur there. You know that that just came out about a year or two ago. You've got that that other one there in the chocolate brown, the trapper hat. You've got another casual hat here, multicolor. Uh, these are all new for 2024. You've got the Spitfire and the coral. Uh, like a pinkish coral type color. That's that's been around there about a year or two. You've got that green uh, trapper style hat, the bucket trapper. You know that that's coming out this year, 2024. This is new. This fuzzy one here with the yellow and black and chocolate. You've got another one here. This uh, kufi style hat here. You know, in the white and uh, black like camel color. Uh, uh, cow cow color with a white and black design. That's new. This is new. This beret multicolor beret here. With the green olive and stuff you know that's new uh white and black uh, knit cap you know with the poly uh material that's that's new this beret here with the multicolor pink red and all that that's new we got the white fuzzy fur here beret this is new this color uh color uh, way here in the sky blue for this beret the jacks beret that's that's new we've got the yellow sunshine beret uh here with the leather trim uh Imitation leather trim, that's new. This one here is new. This casual hat, too. The casual uh, dome hat, too, in the sky blue. That's new as well. Multicolor casual dome hat right here, too. That, that's new. Uh, again, another uh, casual dome hat here. That's new as well. Your your standard uh, uh, summer style hat here. You know, these are new. And this sunshine yellow. This is new for 2024. This beret here. Multicolor beret, uh, the Monty style beret. That's that's new in that colorway there. This also casual hat. Here. All right, folks. So let's continue with the uh, fantastic hat style trends for 2024. Okay, you reviewed those pictures that I just showed you. So let's look at some more hats here. Okay, stuff like this. Caps. Also caps. We're gonna look at some caps uh, with this video as well for uh, 2024. Uh, see, this is classic leather, whatever manufacturer you get it from, classic leather, uh, IV driving cap, you know, whatnot. Uh, there you go. This is a genuine sheepskin leather, really soft, you know, and tender Italian style. This is made in Italy. It's a classic. There's several different versions of this out there, and I've been out there for decades, okay? Uh, but this is classic. You want to wear something like this with your black leather coat, that type of thing. They come in quite a few different colors. You get in brown, you get in tan, etc. But black is a classic that you see people wearing. I mean, for decades, people have been wearing this. You know, also the uh, apple or eight and a quarter panel newsboy version as well with the center button. You see that as well. It's classic, whether in movies, etc. You see people wearing it out and about during the winter time, you know, fall and winter. 
you know, with their black coach. So this is classic. Again, this is coming back for 2024. These never go out of style as well. Also, you've got your uh, your Hawker cap. You know, that's what it's called with this particular manufacturer. It looks like a uh, hit in the quarter panel newsboy cap. Okay, it's got the eight panels kind of stamped on there. They're not cut out and sewn, but they're stamped with the center button. This is classic. This is charcoal color. Something like this comes in several different colors, uh, you know, navy, uh, black, you know, etc. as well. Quite a few. I, be, I bet this particular one, I think, comes in about four or five, uh, maybe even more uh, color tones now or whatnot. They, they add colors every year or they might take out a color, you know, but you got your basic color like your charcoal gray, your black and navy. Those are pretty standard. Um, they, I think they, they even have like a camel now or whatnot. They just came out with that about a a year or two ago or whatnot so um let's see what else we have here you know your classic uh tweed uh donegal tweed with the dots you know the specs whatnot uh you know again something like this you see it in different color varieties this is more of a charcoal black type you know you see tones of red tones of yellow you know, white, black in there with a the center, but it eight and a quarter panel. This is made in Italy, okay, with this particular uh, manufacturer here. It's got the sap lining on the inside. So stuff like this is classic, you know, never goes out of style. They're classic. They've been going on for decades from way, way back, okay. And, you know, uh, they still, they just, they might revise it based on the manufacturer and come up with their own version of it, that type of thing. But the look is classic, okay, for the fall and winter time. Also, your, uh, your uh, what's it called? Your patchwork uh, cap, winter cap. It's got your hang bone design, different types of uh, patchwork, you know, on there, stitched together, center button with uh, uh, kind of like a leather trim, or might be that vinyl leather trim uh, on that one. Yeah, I believe it's, a, it's like a leather trim, you know, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, let's see here, uh, something like this is classic. People have been wearing these for decades as well. This is uh, made in Europe, whatnot. It's got that lining, that uh, plaid lining on the inside there. Okay, stuff is classic. Again, you might see different color versions of this, you know, uh, brown, navy, patchwork version, black, you know, that, et cetera, okay, burgundy. Uh, olive green patchwork, you know, that type of thing, you know, so it's coming back, you know, for 2024 as well. You've got stuff like this, you know, again with your plaid, you know, design, yeah, stuff like this, classic. This is more of that thicker, heavier wool component to it. It in the quarter panel, loose boy cap, center button, okay. It's got a cotton lining on the inside, sewn down visor. Again, another classic look with that uh, uh, plaid look uh, design on there. Never goes out of style. Your berets. Let's see. Uh, uh, no, that's not a beret. Your yeah, stuff like this, like your herringbone. Uh, Again, this has got uh, uh, your herringbone tweed, eight and a quarter panel. This one has got air flaps. Stuff like this are classic for the fall and winter, okay? They come year after year after year. You see these. They've been around for decades, okay? In different color tones, again, you can see this. Uh, so these are always going to be around, man. They're classic looks that never go out of style. You know, your herringbone tweed look. You got your knit caps, okay? They come different versions. This is uh, sort of like a polyester, you know, feels like uh, acrylic, you know, your your rib design, you know, you see different versions of wool, different colorways, you know, with this particular manufacturer, they just have like different colorways, that type of thing, you know, so your knits, caps, and with this design, with the manufacturer patch right there in the front, classic design, it's always going to be around. These are bread and butter uh, uh, headwear for... Uh, 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 caps, uh, knit caps, uh, skull caps, knit caps, uh, you know, for, uh, for the fall and winter. 
season. Okay. Uh, yeah, check out these uh, these other pictures. Yeah, I'm going to show you some for some additional hats. Uh, fantastic uh, hat style trends for 2024. Also, folks, uh, subscribe to the channel. Again, I'm G the Hat Guy. I've got awesome videos. Check out my playlist section. I've got several videos about hats and caps. And uh, also check me out on Facebook, The Hatters Lounge by G the Hat Guy. It's a hat group, social hat group. You can post your own pictures. I want to see your hats. How do you put your hat combination with your outfits together? I want to see your hat collection. So send me a message. Look it up. Search for it. The Hatters Lounge by G the Hat Guy. Once you find it, it's a private hat group. Send me a message to join. I'll add you to the group. And then you can post your own pictures on there as well, okay? Give the video a thumbs up if you're learning something, gaining something, you're enjoying the video, okay? You find something beneficial, okay, with this video. Give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. I've got more awesome hat content coming out. Check out the playlist section. Like I said, I've got several videos about hats and caps, okay? So check out these pictures for additional styles for uh, 20 fantastic style hats, hat style trends for 2024, okay? I'll be right back with you. Yeah, you've got the wide brim in red here. This is another classic. It's coming back year after year. That's a, a, a felt hat. Here's another felt hat, teardrop top in the black with the uh, gray band and the gray trim, edge binding. You've got the olive green hat for the uh, cutoff band hat here with the vintage nail. You've got the safari style hat in the black with a rope band here. Uh, these are classics that uh, have been around for the last uh, few years or so. Here's another one, mustard yellow, wide brim, center dent with a multicolor like a bandana style band and a buckle. Uh, there you go, it's a gambler style. You know, uh, shorter brim, not as long as a typical gambler. Uh, diamond top, black and black. Let's see, diamond top, olive with a black band. This is wool. This is wool. Uh, here's another wool one here uh, with a black on black that uh, you need for black feather. This one with a cutoff band with a long feather and a vintage nail and an olive. It's been around about three, four years or so now. Here's a very popular one, comes in several colors, olive green, gray, this one right here is real popular. It's wool with that particular manufacturer. Wide brim, red, teardrop top. Let's see, uh, here's another one here in the off-white ivory type color, multicolor feather. This is real popular with this particular manufacturer in the coral, light coral color. You've got your uh, five panel cap and a leather. This has been around for at least about five to eight plus years or so. All right, half Got folks. You, uh, wool. Okay, so let's see what else I have for you here. You done checking out those pictures there? You got your classic Shantung. You know, just if I've got a few summer pieces here. Uh, I've got a separate video coming out here for those. Uh, but yeah, these are classic looks, summer looks. This is your uh, Japanese Shantung. Your Shantung uh, hat styles. They've been around for decades as well. Uh, you know, similar to like a Panama look, Panama hat look as well. You know, you've got your your ivory, your off-white tone, or your bleached white, okay, with uh, black uh, hat band. Different manufacturers have their own versions of this stuff. This one's got a lining. It's a little bit more uh, high-end, a little bit. Leather sweatband on the inside, okay. Yeah, so this is another classic spring-summer look, okay. When people are going on vacation, that type of thing, they like to wear those. You know, your classic Panama look, okay. Uh, this is about a grade... Uh, uh, grade uh, 8 Panama uh, straw hat, center dent, two pinches, fedora style, black band, it comes in different colors, bleached, white, off-white, ivory, you know, that type of thing, you can find them, some of them in blue, green, olive, yellow, etc., brown, you know, uh, see that, this one's got an elastic uh, uh, polyester, uh, woven polyester sweatband on the inside there, but yeah, these looks are classic, for spring and summer, they never go out of style. So you're gonna see more of these too for 2024, okay? Your uh, your corduroy caps, okay? This is an eight and a quarter panel hawker cap, okay, center button. These are coming back as well for 2024. This is in the uh, forest dark green, okay? Uh, so that's classic. You know, that one I believe came out maybe almost about uh, four or five years ago. They keep adding colors. They might take away color if it's not doing that good and bring up bring up another color, that type of thing. Uh, here's the same cap here, uh, in, in a quarter panel, uh, almost like a newsboy uh, style cap. In the beige, okay, these are 
classic uh, comes in, you know, uh, comes in like a uh, whiskey type color, you know, black, navy, that type of stuff. You know, you've got some of your, uh, your, uh, what is it? Your bucket, uh, bucket caps, uh, bucket hats, you know, classic. Again, this is the black. Okay, it comes in different uh, colorways. Again, every year, you know, you have some standard colors and then they might add a new color, that type of thing. This is sort of like a whiskey, like a burnt orange type color for the same bucket corduroy, okay, uh, for the fall and winter as well. Okay, these are classics that are coming back. They just came out with these, like I said, around with that particular manufacturer around like three years ago, three, four years ago, somewhere around there. Um, so, yeah, uh, folks, uh, I'm going to, you know, share some more pictures with you here and let you check them out. Again, subscribe to the channel if you're enjoying the video, you're learning something, gaining something, some insights, okay? Subscribe, check out my playlist section. Again, I'm G the Hat Guy. You know, I'm a hat retailer. I make hats as well. You know, I do all kinds of things with hats, hat enthusiasts, all that great stuff. This is your Dockman's hat, you know, in the charcoal. It's an eight panel hat as well, uh, eight panel cap as well. Okay, and like a wool blend. This is classic as well. They have different colorways for something like this. And then you've got the uh, the summer version, like a cotton, cotton blend. You know, they have different colorways. You know, you find an olive green, black, navy, that type of thing. This is sort of like a coral, orange coral type color for the spring and summer. Okay, so all of these are coming back for uh, 2024. Okay, uh, stuff like this. You've got your. Uh, uh, Let's see, this is what uh, your uh, five panel uh, caps, spring and summer caps. Again, these are standard, you know. Uh, they might come up with some new colorways, that type of thing, but these are classic. These have been around, at least they've been bringing them back. I said probably for at least like around the last uh, five, five to eight years, somewhere around there, you know. Uh, I said, yeah, you know, somewhere around there. They keep coming up with different colorways and different designs, but the style remains the same, you know, with these with this particular uh, manufacturer or whatnot, and and some other manufacturers out there as well, similar stuff. Okay, so check out these pictures uh, again. Subscribe to the channel, give the video a thumbs up, share with somebody who might be interested in this type of content. They're trying to learn more about hats, or uh, they're looking again into hats and caps, that type of thing. Check out my playlist section. I've got other videos about hats and caps. You can learn something and gain something from and enjoy. Uh, check me out on Facebook, The Hatter's Lounge by G The Hat Guy. I've got several other videos, okay? Uh, actually, uh, on that hat group, that's The Hatter's Lounge by G The Hat Guy. You can send me a message to join the hat group. It's a private hat group. I need to add you to the group. You can post your own pictures. I want to see your hat collection. You know, what kind of hats and caps do you wear? How do you put your hats and caps together for your outfits, okay? And, uh, yeah, so you can post. Once I, add, once I add you, you can post your own pictures. Search for that. On Facebook, the Hatters Lounge by G the Hat Guy. Okay, it's the name of the hat group. Okay, give the video a thumbs up, share with somebody, say hello in the comment section. Let me know if you enjoyed the video, what not. Uh, if you learned something from the video, okay, say hello. Don't be a stranger. Okay, um, so check out these pictures. This, these additional pictures that I have for you and some fantastic hairstyle trends for 2024. Okay, check out these pictures. Okay, uh, all right, folks, check that out. All right, folks, we got the Bogart style Panama hat here, okay, with a black band. Got another one. This is a different hat, but similar, uh, like a Bogart style. You've got the Bogart here in the toast color with a chocolate brown multicolor feather, okay. You've got a woven hat, multicolor crown with a, a imitation leather band, flat crown, wide brim. You've got a newsboy, Donegal, tweed, herringbone. Those are classic for the fall and winter. You've got your high finish wool. Hat with a center dent. Same hat in the navy with a charcoal band. Folks, subscribe to the channel. Give the video a thumbs up. If you learn something, gain something, subscribe to the channel, folks. Check out my playlist section. I've got more awesome videos there. Safari style in the burgundy upon burgundy color. Same hat in the gray color here. Safari style wool. These are all coming back for 2024. Subscribe. Say hello in the comment section. Let me know what you learned. Uh, check me out. The Hatter's Lounge by G The Hat Guy. You can post your own pictures on Facebook. Okay, that's the hat group on Facebook. Okay, you've got a burgundy, real popular hat with the manufacturer. Thank